Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am feeling so many emotions right now. I am so beyond excited. I feel so confident yet so nervous at the exact same time. I just wanna start off by saying Number one, thank you to everybody on Instagram and Twitter because about an hour ago, I got on Instagram because I was just losing my mind and I posted on my stories how nervous and anxious I have been about filming this video and I'm not kidding you, I have never gotten this many DMs in my entire life, I don't think. I mean, they're just flooding in from friends, from other influencers, just, I mean, like every single time I update it, like every single thing is just, it just says now, 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 like it's not even one minute ago, everything is just happening now. Like as I scroll, just everything, like just thousands of people being so encouraging and sending me so many good vibes and thoughts and prayers. And it sounds so silly, cause it's like, what the hell, bitch, just like, man up and be a CEO, a CEO, like let's do it. But like, it's just been a really hard year, you guys. And I'm really nervous about this. I just wanna be vulnerable with you. I have felt so humiliated and like such a failure. At the same time, I have never been more thankful for anything in my entire life, as weird as it is, because I have never learned so much from an experience that I learned from my first launch. And I truly believe in the depths of my soul that I was put through that situation for a reason because I had a major wake up call, like major. I was so confident in my first launch that I was cocky and I definitely took the time to step back and see where all of the errors and the mistakes were made and I was able to correct those. The reason that I am launching this is not for myself because me as myself, I am terrified and I'm scared and I'm freaking out, but I am doing this for the girls and the boys that I meet every single time I leave my house, every time I do a meet and greet, when I open up my DMs, when I hear your stories on Twitter, the people that are constantly telling me how my videos have impacted them and changed their lives, I am doing this for you guys, for those girls, for those boys who are constantly saying those things to me and encouraging me, I'm like, I gotta give it one more go. I gotta get back up on the horse and I need to continue to try to be that role model. I need to try. And it sounds so silly because like it's just makeup, but it's not just makeup to me. It's more than makeup. I'm gonna keep going and I'm not gonna stop until I say that it's time to stop. I am in control of my own destiny and only myself and same for you. So excited to introduce this collection to you guys and I hope that you just love it so much because I have been working on this before my lipsticks ever launched. This has taken quite a while. We started this at the very beginning of the year because we do have several different products in this collection and they are made from several different places, which is amazing. All places that specialize in the products that I am launching and going into this launch it is very different. I have over 20 new people on my team. If this collection barely sells, that's okay. But once the people who do buy it get it in their hands, you guys are gonna die because it is so damn good. Every single time I do my makeup and I wear these products, I'm like, wait, really? Like these are my products? Like what the hell? Like I am blessed to be able to create these and to be able to use these and to be able to offer them to you. So I am rambling, I know, but you guys who watch me know me that I am just very passionate and I just wanna talk constantly but I'm gonna cut it off and I wanna jump into the actual product and show you guys my holiday collection for 2019. Okay, I wanna start off by showing you guys my holiday PR package. I've had this in my house for quite some time and I'm sorry if there's fingerprints on it because everybody that comes in and out of my house has been opening this and looking at it. But here we have it right here. I love this, I love this so much. I, you know that I had to go over the top for the holidays, right? Like, I mean, it wouldn't matter if it was January or February, I would still go over the top. But inside we have the Jaclyn Cosmetics Highlight Collection. Like, okay, first of all, I know for a fact 
that my supporters who have been around forever, like my Jackpack, my Hillsters, my Ride or Dies, I know that you guys feel my heart right now on what this means to me because I am obsessed with Highlight. I created Champagne Pop with Becca and that was just like the most incredible experience ever. And I have been dying to create my own products for so long. I have been working on this for such a good amount of time, you guys, and they're so freaking beautiful. So not only are you getting Highlight, but you are getting three different formulas. Because you know me, I can't just highlight with one highlight. I need three different types of highlight. I need to glow in all different ways in all different regions. So I'm giving you guys three different formulas with three different brushes for your formula. <laughs> it's my dream. Oh my God, I'm so excited right now. <laughs> So now that I have revealed to you guys that my holiday collection is nothing but highlights, I obviously am gonna swatch all of them, give you a full breakdown, why did I develop three, what makes them so unique, and all the shades for all the different skin tones out there. I wanna start off with talking about the highlight palettes. These palettes are so freaking unique and so beautiful. I cannot wait for you guys to get these in your hands. So we have two of them right here. We have the flash palette and the flare palette. And I just love the names so much. I wanna say the biggest thank you ever to one of my best friends and the most amazing product coordinator of all time, Anthony, for coming up with these names with me, the flash and the flare. So we have a light to medium and a medium dark, which are so individually beautiful. So I'm gonna jump in and give you guys swatches and a full breakdown of the highlights and what make these so special. So first and foremost right here, I wanna introduce to you guys the flash palette. We have four unique, individual custom highlights. These were all handcrafted in Italy, which is the coolest thing to me because I've always heard about the baking process in Italy and how amazing it is and how extensive and how expensive. And me and my entire team actually got to go to Milan, Italy, to the lab and see this entire process of how they do it. And it's really cool because when you guys receive this palette in the mail, you're gonna see that there is a card in every single one of them that explains the process to you and how they're all unique because they are hand baked. So if you can see, there's kind of like this little threading that goes through all of them and they're all gonna be different. You can buy two palettes and both of them, the shade itself is gonna remain the same, but the like the way it looks, the marbling is gonna be different, which is so cool. It kind of reminds me of like diesel jeans. You always get that tag on diesel jeans that say like, these are all handmade and they're all gonna be a little bit different. The wash is gonna be a little bit different. It's the same thing, but this formula is so buttery and so beautiful and it just melts into the skin. Like it feels like a second layer of skin, honestly. And I cannot believe that I had the experience of creating a highlight in Italy. Like I remember working at Mac thinking like, oh my God, one day if I could just create highlighter, oh my God. And the fact that I got to go to Milan and actually be a part of this for my own brand is so exciting. So this right here, we have the flash palette. I'm gonna give you all the swatches right now. All right, so in this palette, we have four unique shades. The first one we have Gleam, then Iced, Sparks, and Mesmerize. All different shades that I created along with my team to look beautiful on a light to medium slash tan skin tone. Of course, if you are in dark complexion range, you can still, of course, live your best life. Use these as eyeshadows, anything else, but this is geared towards the light medium skin tone range for those of you who are actually interested in purchasing this and what's gonna look great on you. And then the Flare palette is more for the deep dark skin tone. Okay, so first let's go in with the shade Gleam. This could be a little interesting because my nails are so long right now you guys know like I never do nails this long like this is intense but you know what when in LA we're gonna step outside of our comfort zone right so just that swatch right there can you see how intense that is just from a little swirl on my hand like it's and the way it feels it feels like you are touching just butter and what makes this formula so unique is the fact that typically when you go with a baked formula it's a little bit more dry and chalky this one is so smooth and so buttery so let's get the first swatch and i'm gonna barely put any pressure for you guys just to see how well that swatch just glides right across the skin. Obviously, this is my wrist. There's no primer, there's no stickiness. I don't even have moisturizer on right now. This is just my LA dry skin with a clean, easy, light swatch. All right, so let's go in with the second shade, Iced. Again, you can just see in real time how intense that is on the finger. And let's go in and give that just a sweet little swatch. 
again can you guys see how little pressure i'm putting on there like for instance if i go in with more and i cycle we want to pack that bitch on it gets so much more aggressive like that's just minimal swatching right there third we have the shade sparks which there's something about sparks that just like gets me going because it's got that yellow undertone but it's not like yellow and it's not gold. It's just so beautiful, especially when you're fair. Because for me, when I don't have a spray tan, I'm naturally fair. I always want that like golden glow, but I can't find it. And for me, that sparks. Like I created that shade for that fair skin tone where I still feel like it's a little bronzy and a little golden and a little summery, but it's not like yellow and it doesn't make me look muddy. And then last but not least in the flash palette is the shade Mesmerize, which is our rosy gold shade right here so freaking gorgeous like it has it's such a perfect mixture of 50% rose and 50% gold so as you move your cheeks around it's got such a beautiful iridescent vibe to it like can you see that on camera let me close this so I don't blind you like look at that so we have four very different, very unique shades that are all gonna look so beautiful on fair to medium skin tones, which makes me so excited because I didn't wanna come out with a palette that had, you know, like a light, a medium, and then a deep, you know? At first I was thinking like, okay, let me do one palette for the holidays. And it was just like, I can't do that. Like, I don't like that as a consumer. Like when I purchase a highlight palette, I like it to have just the shades that I wanna wear, you know? Cause like I'm selfish like that. Like I just wanna take a palette where I'm like, I use every single one of these, you know? So that's why I created the flash and the flare because those of you who have deeper skin will love the second palette and those of you who have lighter skin will love the first palette. All right, so now on to the flare palette. It's the exact same packaging, exact same component. It's got a really good, like hefty weight to it. And I didn't even mention prior that the mirror inside of this component is amazing. Like it's the kind of mirror where you're like, oh my God, that's really how I look right now. Like, Lord Jesus, I need some help. Like it's it's a very high quality mirror. And then we again, just have four shades right here for deeper skin tone. So let's get started with the first shade, which is Glow Up. This shade I can actually wear if I have a great tan going on. It is such a beautiful undertone. A little bit of a rosiness to it, a little bit of bronzy. You can see on my skin right now, like where I'm at with my tan, it's actually not like that much of a highlight because I am way more fair right now, but still it's just like the most beautiful bronzy shade that's so good on just like that uber tan skin tone. The next shade that we have right here is Made You Look. And this one, I 100% personally cannot wear this as a highlight no matter what. It's definitely made for a deeper tone, but I have worn this many times as an eyeshadow because you can see how beautifully bronzy it is. To me, this is just a core bronze highlight. If you've got deeper skin, this is gonna be just like that go-to shade in the palette for you where it's not gonna look muddy, it's not gonna look ashy, it's gonna have that beautiful golden bronze on your skin tone. These last two shades right here, which are Exposure and Turned On, these two were the most challenging for me because I am very fair naturally and the deepest that I ever get, no matter how much I spray tan, is still not a dark skin tone, obviously, you know? So I really needed a lot of help because obviously I can't put it on myself and be like, this is gonna be great on dark skin. I don't have dark skin, you know? So I asked my friends who have deep skin. I actually try them on Jordan's friends. A lot of them who are very, very deep in tone and then we also hired out 40 different people with deep skin tones as well to come in and help me create these two. So that was really special to me because when building a brand, you just can't do it alone. And that's another thing that I have learned in this process is that you need help sometimes. So I really love these two shades because I personally could never wear either of these as a highlight, but they're so beautiful on deep skin, which you guys will see in my campaign images, which will be on my website and also on my Instagram. So this shade right here is Exposure and it is so freaking beautiful on deep skin. I can't even begin to tell you. Like on me, this is like totally an eyeshadow. Like that could never ever work as a highlight on me. It could work as like a deep bronzer on me, like a shimmer bronzer, but never a highlight. But on deep skin, oh my gosh, it's so gorgeous. It's a very neutral shade. It just brings so much life to the skin. And then the last one right here is the shade Turned On. And I think this is so special because 
we put this on one of the deepest skin tones that we could find and in a million years like this would never be a highlight on my skin tone right like it looks so red so berry but you guys will see images of this shade on deep skin and it is like out of this world just like brings you to life and makes you glow so hardcore it's so gorgeous so as you can see from this palette only one out of four shades actually would work on my skin tone when I'm my absolute darkest, which isn't even right now, but they are all meant for deeper skin and they are so gorgeous. Okay, so now that we have covered the Accent Light formulation, which is the two palettes, I wanna move on to the next formula, which is Mood Light. You guys know how much I love an inner glow. I have talked about inner glow, bridal glows, bridal beauties for years on my channel, always trying out new products. This is what makes me look like I'm just going from within. Like I love a product that doesn't make me necessarily look like I am highlighted. Like I didn't try too hard, but it's just like that radiant, beautiful gleam that works on any age, any skin, it's gonna work no matter what. And so I created the mood light because it doesn't matter what mood you're in. So what makes this so special is the fact that the one of the main ingredients is mica, which is known for its blurring and its smoothing effect. So it's kind of like, face tune in a jar. You can also use this product without makeup. Like if you just moisturize, you can use your fingers and just rub this like all over your cheeks. I personally use this to set my entire face along with like a normal setting powder. I just mix it in and use it everywhere. Like that's what I have today. My entire face is set with mood light because it just gives that all over like, ah, like it doesn't look like you actually have like a beaming highlight. But if you go in with a smaller, more dense brush and you hit it on targeted areas, you can make it very intense and you can also add like a little bit of like a fix plus, any sort of setting spray and make it beam. So I'm really, really excited and really passionate about this specific product because it's just, I just feel like it's really different and we don't see it too often on the market and that makes me really excited. Okay, so the first shade I'm gonna swatch for you guys is the shade Do Me. And this is gonna be kind of difficult to swatch on camera because of the fact that it is such a light, very, how do I put it? Like feathery, very like, it's not dense. It's like light and feathery and almost feels moisturizing and it's very blurring. It's not gonna be so easy to show up on camera, but we're gonna do our best for you guys to see it. Again, I'm gonna be swatching. God, these nails are making it so impossible for me to get anything. I've got to put it into the cap and then work from there. So keep in mind that we are working on totally clean skin with no moisturizer, no anything on it whatsoever. So it's not gonna come off like it will on the face, but that's what it looks like on the finger. And then once you get it on, it feels more, I'm gonna go back and forth because this definitely isn't like a powder like the other highlights where it's like one swipe and you're like, boom. This one, because it is so light and so feathery and has like that really super blurring effect in it, I'm gonna like kind of rub it in like it's an actual face powder and you can see how light it is. I just adore this product for all over the face. It really does give you such a blurring effect. And if you are older in age and you wanna purchase something from the collection, I would recommend this number one, and then the palettes, the accent lights, number two, because they are so light and feathery and blurring and they just feel moisturizing on the skin. Okay, so next I have the shade Brighten Up, which is such a beautiful color. This is my favorite color to use all over my face. It's got like a little bit of a neutral beigey undertone, a little bit of pink, but it's got such a beautiful gleam in it. So I'll put this all over my cheeks and then a lot of times I'll take the first shade that I swatched right here, Do Me, and I'll put that on my forehead and like lower here. But I will put Brighten Up all over the cheek area as I am setting my powder with either a brush or a beauty sponge. Okay, so next we have the shade Brilliant. I have to apologize. I just had to go over and take care of my dogs because Lolly and Tipsy had a branch from a tree that they were chewing on back there on the couch. And my sweater came down and kind of removed the first two products. So you can't really see them as much. But this right here is where we start getting into deeper skin tones where it no longer is gonna look flattering on my skin tone. And again, this is the shade Brilliant, and that's when we start to move in. This is much more peachy than the first two, and this I can only wear on my cheeks if I have a good spray tan, which right now I do not, and you can clearly 
see that. So you're gonna have to be a little bit more medium skin tone to wear Brilliant. Okay, so for the fourth one in line, Carrots, right here. This one is definitely easier for me to wear than Brilliant. As you can see, Brilliant definitely is much more orangey, peachy undertone. This one I can wear if I've got a good spray tan and I can use it all over the face, but I have to have a deep spray tan and I keep referencing my skin tone just because you guys watch my videos, you see my skin tone. I can go from extremely fair where I'm up in this range and then I can get I can get pretty tan when I go like my double tanning sessions. So I'm just letting you guys know like where I range at and I can definitely do carrots all over the face when I've got a hefty spray. Okay, so right here, this is the last shade in the Mood Light range for now. This is such a beautiful shade. I cannot wear this at all under any circumstances. It does not look good on me but it is so gorgeous on deep, dark skin. We try this out on several different men and ladies who have deep, deep, deep skin, and it is so gorgeous. It is not ashy. It's such a beautiful caramel undertone. It's not too red. It has no gray in it whatsoever, so it's not gonna make you look just like dusty and all wrong and not right. It is freaking beautiful. You can see the lineup right there. Again, this highlight is meant for many purposes all over the face with or without makeup or if you just want that glow from within you can dampen your brush make it more of a targeted highlight but it has so many different purposes you can do so much with mood light which is why i love it you guys know how much i love just like that glow from within because even on days where i don't like a beaming like bam highlight i still have to have some sort of glow which is why i love and appreciate this product so much okay so the last formulation that i created for this collection is the beaming light which ah it's so hard because every single one of them i want to say is my favorite but that's why i created three different formulas because i use all three literally on a daily basis i have all three formulas on my face right now and I do my makeup the exact same way every single time I've gotten ready for the past several months. Of course, when I am not filming a YouTube video because I would not show my products on YouTube until they are completely finalized and ready to go. But I just have such a special place in my heart for this one because for those of you out there who want a blinding highlight, who is going like, it's gonna be so intense. This is gonna be your go-to right here. You guys are going to be absolutely shook. I had so much fun creating this because I kept being like, no, more, 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 give me more. Like they are so intense, you guys. So I will take this and literally just put it at a targeted area. This is not a highlight that I'm gonna personally take and rub it all over my face because it is so beaming and so beautiful. What makes this formulation so beautiful to me is it is a powder to cream formula. So when you first put it on your brush, it's 100% loose powder right here. It looks like fairy dust. But then once you apply it and it goes onto the skin, it literally feels like you have a cream on your skin. It's so beautiful and so moisturizing. So the first shade that we have right here is Extra. And oh my gosh, are you guys ready to see like how intense just one little itty bitty swipe is? Like I'm not even pressing. Like that's just, that's just the product. Like look at how creamy this is. And we have five shades. Like, you have your options. I cannot even pick my favorite color, so don't ask me to. But I will say that when I'm really, really, really pale, this is my favorite. <laughs> Next, we have the shade Bomb. I want you guys to see how little pressure, like I can literally barely even touch my skin and see how incredible this is. And then when you blend it out, it is just, so buttery, so creamy. It just looks wet on your skin and that color in general, like that perfect rosy beigey gold. Like, are you kidding me? Like, don't even start, don't even start. I'm really, really proud of my shade range in these because I feel like I did not just take ideas from other companies and say, okay, like I just wanna do it like this. This is a top seller. Like I really took my time with my team on building beautiful shades for different skin tones and bringing in tons of different people with a different range and really making sure that it looked amazing on their skin and they really appreciated it. So I'm very, very proud of my range. Okay, so now for third shade in line, we have Amped, which is a very pinky, rose gold undertone let me just get that in there for you initially this is so gorgeous over blush like of course beautiful on its own with like a fluffy brush but if you put like a little coral pinky blush on and then do a little swoop of this over top 
it just like makes the blush just like melt. It is so gorgeous and just so girly and feminine. This is honestly, these three colors right here, these are my top three. I use these three all the time. Okay, fourth shade in line, we have High Volt. This shade starts to look absolutely beautiful once we get into deep skin tone. It looks so rosy on deep skin tone. It's got like a little bit of a purple berry undertone if you can see it on me. This is not a highlight on me whatsoever. Will never be a highlight on my skin. I couldn't even force it. But on deeper skin tone, it is absolutely gorgeous, which you again will see on my website, on my campaign images with my models who have much different skin tones than I do. Okay, so now we have the deepest shade in the beaming, which is called Megawatt. If you guys can see the shade right here in the cap, this again was a shade that I needed a lot of help creating because I could never in a million years wear this on my skin tone. Because it's not just about developing a shade that's dark enough to flatter deep skin tones, but it's about making sure that you have the right undertone for those deep skin tones. So I needed a lot of help with this and I'm so thankful that we took our time and research and undertones to make this so beautiful because because it's so gorgeous. I have used this as an eyeshadow because it's just so damn beautiful. I actually have these on my lid right now. I am wearing these two right here combined all over my eyes because I just love them as an eyeshadow as well. Although I can't wear a couple of these shades on the skin, I can wear them on my eyelids, especially if you dampen them with a wet brush. It's like, holy moly, it takes it to the next level. So you can see right there, that is my beaming collection right now. And I am so proud of them, so proud of the formula, so proud of the shade range. And I know that you guys are gonna die, die for <laughs> this collection right here because they're beyond and unlike any other, seriously, amazing. Okay, so last but not least in this collection, I have three custom highlight brushes. You guys know how dedicated I am to my highlight and my brushes and how obsessed I am when it comes to the application because if you don't have the right brush for your highlight, you're gonna think your highlight sucks. So I wanted to create incredible brushes that go along with the theme. Now, although we have named them certain things, like this is the mood light brush, that does not mean that you can only use this for mood light. I don't, like I mix it up and I use this for all different things. But it was so much fun creating a brush that really complements the actual formulation since I do have three formulas. Why why not create three brushes in case you only are interested in one formula you can get that same brush and you know that's gonna be great for you and your needs right okay so first off right here we have the mood light powder brush and this is made for let me just show you so you have like the actual reference because I know there's a lot of products in this and you may forget the mood light right here which is the one that is gonna be like the all over face just like slap it on and go makeup no makeup whatever any age can wear it we created a fatter thicker brush because it's so easy just to dunk it right into it and just go all over the cheeks forehead, face, wherever you want. It's not a targeted brush. It's just gonna be great for that all over glow. You can even use it for an under eye situation and just get it on and move on with your life. It makes it super, super easy. This is the Beamy Light brush and it is super tiny. It's like a little fan brush. And what I love about this is I created it so it's not too dense because I can't stand it when I try to apply my highlight with a brush that's so dense that you're like, What's it doing? Like it's not even picking up the product, it's not dispersing it. It's so fluffy. All of my brushes are created with one of the newest technologies for synthetic brushes. So these are not real animal hair. They're all cruelty free, like everything else in this entire collection. I wanted to create a brush that felt like it was real hair, but it's not. And I'm really, really, really proud of these brushes because I was looking at natural hairs for quite a while and synthetic just wasn't cutting it. And then we were able to actually get on board with this technology and it is so, beautiful so this one right here is just like that spot like boom moment right down the nose on the cheekbone right above the brow bone little chin moment and it's just so easy to get that targeted highlight but it's not too dense so it's very easy to work with and then the third brush and not the least brush <laughs> this is the accent highlighter brush which is made for the flash and the flare palettes the hand-baked highlighters from Italy I love this brush so much I think out of all three this is my most used because it, I I feel like it's the most universal. I can use it with all three products and I never have an issue with it. So I have a million of these just laying all over my vanity at all times because I just pick them up and I just tap it, tap it, like do my thing all over my face. It's the perfect size. It's so soft, you guys. Like when you get it, you're just gonna wanna rub it all over your face and just feel it. It is so freaking soft, but it's not the kind of softness where it doesn't pick up product, if you know what I mean. Like when you get a natural brush, a lot of times you're like, 
okay, this is so incredibly soft on my face, but why is it not dispersing the product? That's what I love about this. And the fact that it's synthetic is like, it really picks up product and puts it on the face and keeps it there. It's beautiful. And if you can see a close up of these brushes, I love them so much because they have that gradient ombre effect of that silver glitter that just fades down to that totally clear handle, a silver ferrule with my logo on it. And then it also has the brush number on the back. I'm so excited that I was able to produce this collection for you guys and give you such amazing high-end quality brushes that you will die for and they're so comfortable to hold as well okay you guys so that wraps up <laughs> the full reveal of my holiday collection i am so excited and also so anxious and my nerves are tweaking out right now about the fact that this video is actually going live and you're going to see these products typically my return policy is 30 days but we are going to be extending it for the holidays for 45 days that way if you feel like purchasing this the day that it launches for a friend or a family member you're still able to get your money back and be able to exchange it for something else if the person that you give it to doesn't like it which i'm really excited about that because I don't like it when I give something to a friend and then they can't return it. So I wanna make sure that you guys are able to have that option for your friends and family. So on top of that, we also are gonna have a ton of different bundles on the website on the day of launch. You can check all that out on the website on JacquelineCosmetics.com. Also, I'm gonna have so much information in the description box right below this video of all different bundles, prices, launch time, where you can find it, all that jazz. But it will be launching on November 26th at nine o'clock a.m. Pacific Standard Time on JacquelineCosmetics.com. I will also make sure that I have up a ton of different images and Instagram stories all over social media of different skin tones so you can see all these highlights for what they really are. I've never seen a brand personally launch three different formulas in one launch with several different shade ranges. So it might be like, wait, what? Very overwhelming, like what do I get? I'm not really sure if you're interested in it. So I will make sure to post a lot of images and also give you so many more details all over my social medias of what makes these so special. And going forward, I'll be able to share more with you about that. But I always love highlights so much and I'm so excited that I'm able to give you guys three formulas that I love and adore so much that can be worn together or separate. And it doesn't matter who you are, how old you are, what your skin type is or what your skin tone is, there is something for you in this collection. And that just makes me so happy and I just wanna say thank you so much to all my subscribers who have been there for me and the people who have straight up just told me like, hey, I love you, but like I wanted more from you and I want something better from you, I appreciate you as well. And I had you in mind the entire time that I was creating this holiday collection and everything that I'm working on in the future. So I just wanna say thank you to everybody, no matter if it was harsh or not, just thank you for being honest with me and letting me know how I need to better my brand and better myself. And thank you for having patience with me because this is so brand new and it's very intimidating and I just want to be the absolute best for you guys. So yeah, that's it. Thank you, you guys. And I can't wait for the 26th. I'm so nervous. I'm so freaking nervous. I like, I came in vegan, but it's going to be great because these products are so incredible and I have every amount of trust and confidence in the entire world that I could possibly have in my body there in these products. So I hope that you love them as much as I love them. And yeah, that's it. Happy holidays, you guys. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.